All right, we're joined by the tech goddess, as people call her on Satellite Guys, Leslie Harper. <laughs> Leslie's going to tell us about the new Dish Network 722K, which is coming very soon. Leslie, tell us a little bit about it. All righty. Well, what you know about the 722, you know about the 722K. So dual tuner, HD and SD outputs on TV1, SD outputs on TV2. But two things are pretty cool about this. First of all, you've got a new remote control. Which uh, the TV1 and TV2 each have these remote controls. There's still a key that flips at the bottom, but actually in the back here, I don't know if this one has it. Nope. In the TV2 one, there's actually a switch between IR and UHF. So that replacement remote control then deals with your infrared or your UHF Pro connections there to make it TV1 or TV2. So that means you can have TV1 UHF Pro or TV2 IR, which really doesn't work too well because you've got to be in the room with it. So, this remote, obviously very different um, in as far as its coloring and so forth, but the same basic characteristics. you still got your blue buttons at the top, do your channel up, down, left, right, select, uh, mode buttons. We now say DVD instead of VCR. We caught up with the rest of the world. Um, these four buttons then are for future interactive applications. So the soft keys, as people will call them. So we've taken the colors off of the DVR buttons, so that's a little bit different still have your number pad, but notice this system wizard, the zero at the bottom, that's going to start something that allows the remote control to talk to the receiver to be able to record or, or to store things like the timers, uh, your settings, your HDTV settings in the remote so that if you have to replace the receiver, no worries, your codes are all here, your timers are all here, very cool, get a new receiver in, get them talking and that's what the two-way capabilities is so this will actually store the remote codes so that if something happens with your remote control no worries you can get the remote codes back in your remote so very fun remote control I really like this guy the other thing I don't have a cartridge to show you but this has an external or a separate optional MT2 OTA module we call it very fancy there that allows you to have it has one port one coax port but dual di uh, dual digital over the air tuners so the 722 has a single over-the-air tuner digital inside, but the module then has one port to do two digital over-the-air tuners, and it has a TV1 channel 34 coax output if you need that for any reason. Right, so a lot of people are wondering how many things can you record at one time? Can you record four things at once? Yes, you, so you can do two live uh, satellite broadcasts, you can be doing two live digital over the air broadcasts, and you have your uh, video on demand content that's already on the box, and you can be doing a dish online if you've got this hooked up to the ethernet. So well, that's, that's, that's great. And, uh, Another thing this, this unit does that the current 722 doesn't is the person on TV number two can watch live over the air broadcast. That's right. Yeah, with the cartridge. Mm -hmm. yep. and, and that's the 722K from Dish Network and Echo Star. Thank you, Leslie.